How are you doing? Yay! I'm so excited to sing and learn with you again. Oh, if you're new to my channel, my name is Teacher Celine. Can everybody say hello, Teacher Celine? And welcome to my online learning channel. <laughs> For today's lesson, we will have a storytelling session about Valentine's Day. You know what kids? Valentine's Day is fast approaching and I'm so excited! <laughs> Valentine's Day is a special day when people celebrate love. It is celebrated on February 14. It is also called St. Valentine's Day. People usually greet and send gifts to loved ones on this day. It's a great opportunity for everyone to express their love. Before we start our story time, let's sing a song. This song is a good one for you to learn about Valentine's Day. The title of the song is... Skinamarink. TC Kids, I want to hear your voices loud and clear. Don't be shy with Teacher Selene, okay? Because I am here to sing and learn with you. Are we ready? Hey, let's start! Get ready! Skin a ring a ding a ding Skin a ring a do I love you Skin a ring a ding a ding Skin a ring a do I love you I love you in the morning and in the afternoon I love you in the evening and underneath the moon Are you all ready for story time? Hmm. Let me check if you are ready. If Teacher Celine says, Are we ready? Are we ready? You will answer, Yes, we are. Yes, we are. <laughs> Can we do that one more time? One, two, three, go. Are we ready? Are we ready? Yes, we are. Yes, we are. Great job! Let me get my book. I have a story. What could it be? What? <laughs> I have a story. Who could it be? What? <laughs> I have a story. What could it be? Ta-da! The title of the story is... Guess How Much I Love You Written by Sam McBrantney Illustrated by Anita Jaram If you have this book, go get it so you can read along with me. When Teacher Celine is reading a story, hmm, what should we do? We should open our eyes, open your eyes, open our ears, lock our lips, hands on our lap, sit like a pretzel and eye on the book. Guess How Much I Love You by Sam McBratney, illustrated by Anita Jaron. Little Nut Brown Hair, who was going to bed, had a long tie to Big Nut Brown's hair's very long ears. He wanted to be sure that Big Nut Brown Hair was listening. Guess how much I love you, he said. Oh, 
I don't think I could guess that, said Pig Not Brown Hair. This much, said Little Not Brown Hair, stretching out his arms as wide as they could go. Big Not Brown Hair had even longer arms. But I love you this much, he said. Hmm, that is a lot, thought Little Not Brown Hair. I love you as high as I can reach, said Little Not Brown Hair. I love you as high as I can reach, said Big Not Brown Hair. That is quite high, thought Little Not Brown Hair. I wish I had arms like that. Then Little Not Brown Hair had a good idea. He tumbled upside down and reached up the tree trunk with his feet. I love you all the way up to my toes, he said. And I love you all the way up to your toes, said Big Not Brown Hair, swinging him up over his head. I love you as high as I can hop, <laughs> laughed Little Not Brown Hair, bouncing up and down. But I love you as high as I can hop, smiled Big Not Brown Hair, and he hopped so high that his ears touched the branches above. That's good hopping, thought Little Not Brown Hair. I wish I could hop like that. I love you all the way down the lane as far as the river, cried Little Not Brown Hair. I love you across the river and over the hills, said Big Not Brown Hair. That's very far, thought Little Not Brown Hair. He was almost too sleepy to think anymore. Then he looked beyond the thorn bushes out into the big dark night. Nothing could be further than the sky. I love you right up to the moon, he said and closed his eyes. Oh, that's far, said Big Not Brown Hair. That is very, very far. Big Not Brown Hair settled Little Not Brown Hair into his bed of leaves. He leaned over and kissed him good night. Then he lay down close by and whispered with a smile, I love you right up to the moon and back. The end. Hi everyone! My name is Galex. My name is Alonso. Today we're celebrating Valentine's Day and we're gonna make a Valentine's Day card for mommy and daddy. On this part, you write the name of your loved one. Your mommy and daddy. <laughs>
of our fun lesson for today. I hope you enjoyed learning with Teacher Celine. But before we end our session, let's sing our goodbye song. Everybody, arms up, get ready. Pa -dum -pa -dum -pa -dum -pum -pum. It's time for us to go. We had a happy day. We'll see you all again. We'll see you then, my friend. It's time for us to go. We had a happy day. We'll see you again, my friends. Bum, bum. Can everybody say goodbye and thank you, Teacher Celine? If you enjoyed this lesson, please don't forget to like and to subscribe to my channel. See you next time, kids. Happy Valentine's Day. Goodbye.